and enjoyable day for a successful second day for the birthplace of Route 66 Festival that's going on in downtown Springfield. And that's where we find KY3's Dustin Hodges. Dustin, how's it going there tonight? Follow the car. Great, great, great. The car and motorcycle show that they had here on day two brought hundreds of classic cars and motorcycle enthusiasts here to downtown Springfield. And I'm standing by some of those motorcycle enthusiasts now who are watching a motorcycle stunt show here behind me. I'll let you guys take a look at that because this is pretty neat. One of the more exciting things that has gone on down here at the birthplace of Route 66 Festival. Now, these are professional stuntmen doing all kinds of tricks on their motorcycles. And I'll let you watch that while we talk about some of the other stuff going on down here. They've got a diagnostics machine here uh, in the motorcycle section of the festival where they get two bikes on it side by side and it's actually really cool. They they got a, a stoplight that they give them a green light and the two bikes run just as fast as they can hammer the throttle down. After one of them has gone a quarter mile they get a red light there and it basically simulates a drag race between the two motorcycles so that's been pretty exciting so far. They just finished the motorcycle parade on College Street and of course College College Street here through downtown Springfield is where the original Route 66 did run through downtown Springfield here. We've got two music stages that are going simultaneously with music being played and of course Marshall, Tuck Marshall Tucker Band will be playing at 8 o'clock at the Galois tonight. And on College Street, west of the square over there, that's where all those classic cars are. They've got all makes and models, muscle cars, hot rods, and, of course, trucks out there. And this will continue again tomorrow for day three of the birthplace of Route 66 Festival. That gets kicked off at 8 o'clock in the morning with that 6.6. .6 6K and 3.3K run. And do remember that they've got the streets here in downtown blocked off while the festival is going on. So if folks need to do any driving around here, they need to remember that and find an alternate route. Live in downtown Springfield, Dustin Hodges, KY3 News. And we do have everything you need to.